Now, when you're trying to change the data of that table, it's different because the variables are kind of stored inside of it. And so there's two ways to access it. The first is you can talk or basically touch one of those paths. And so for example, conscious health and name, they are kind of like key values in the actual table itself. If you want to access it, you literally just access the name. So you say person name, and that'll give you the actual name for the person. So let's get rid of the print statement for the person itself. So we should just see the name print out. There you go. So you see just the name and you can do that with every other property. Another way to do it is you can use quotes or single quotes. I'm going to use single just because I'm lazy. I don't want to type that other one. And you can dynamically access it using a string. So there's not much of a difference in terms of when you're reading this between these two, where you actually sit using the dot. It's pretty much this object dot key or object dot property name, however you want to call it, right? It's the same, same thing, same value that it gets access to, it's same object. However, this has a lot of flexibility when you're dynamically building tables, for example, inventory item one. If you don't want to add the name to it, you could attach the current index, and we'll show you that later. So the, these have a lot of really flexible abilities. So we're going to focus on dots for now. And you can mutate them the same way as well. So I can say first name equals... Albus, and then print the person. And you can see that after we change the name, the object is the same, the conscious is the same, the health is the same, but we've changed the name. And so you can mutate objects. And if anybody's referencing this, they'll get that particular object and see that it's new value when they print it out or access its properties. And so that's how you can access particular properties of a table and see some of its properties in different ways and then set it and change it, change those values.